So even though I've just done an entire course teaching you how to migrate from AngularJS to Angular using the official ng upgrade module, I've also written and spoken about another method, a method that I've come, come up with, which is much, much simpler, and maybe for some situations would be better. And this section, I'm going to cover that method. Now, I've given it various names <laughs> over, the, over the course of the last six months when I've been working with it and thinking of it. Right now, I call it iframe migration. You can find out details about it if you go on my blog. And you can find that it's called, well, on my blog, it's called Bulletproof AngularJS Migration Using iFrames. You can read up about it there. I spoke about it at Angular Connect in London, which is one of the largest Angular conferences in the world. So I spoke about it then. And if you want to, you can find it on the Angular Connect uh, YouTube channel. You can find my talk uh, where I speak about it then. It's actually called From Donkey to Unicorn. So I've given it various names uh, over the last six months, but it is all the same topic. And what that's what I'm gonna talk about today in this lecture is I wanna talk about this alternative method, why you may wanna use, why you may want to use it, and some uh, just look taking a little bit of a look at the source code. I'm not gonna take you deeply into the source code, but just a little bit of a look into the source code because all the source code is available online for you to take a look in if this is something that interests you. So source code can be found if you go into my blog and you find the article, you can find the source code here. GitHub, Joake, Alt, AngularJS migration using iframes demo. So all the source code that I'm gonna talk about is available here. 